Grand Rising, y'all. Just got up not too long ago. Um, I had to go ahead and get showered. Today I'm going to get my visa today. And my teammates picking me up. So I know we got like a four hour drive to get to the place. And don't know what to expect over there. Um, talked to Martin. He told me that I most likely won't be there all day. So I'm hoping I don't have to be out there all day at this uh, city for four hours because it's a four hour drive. And I hopefully the process is not that long. It's probably an hour and a half and I just come home and uh, get home for another another four and a half hours to come back. So hopefully just a simple thing to do and get the process done, get all the documents together and bang it out and come back. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just ready to get this thing over with. But I am excited to see a different city and see what Berlin have to offer. It's gotta be pretty cool, you know what I'm saying? So I'm excited about that for sure. Yep. Man, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, go ahead and subscribe, like, and share. Today is gonna be an awesome day. I can feel it and I am just ready to make the best out of everything, man. So I'm just blessed to be in the situation and I'm ready to learn something new. Oh yes, it's a quite of adventure, y'all. Quite of adventure. I need to find somebody who could dread my hair. My hair is looking um yeah, that's going to be my next task for sure. So I'm learning how to use this thing right here. Um, I need to know what is these, what do these mean? <laughs> so I'm just going to try to put something in and click on that start button. Hopefully I press the right button and that thing is starting. So my plan is to wash my clothes, get back, dry them, because that's important. And I don't want to leave too much load because my apartment is really small and I don't want to have like a, a extinguished smell in my apartment. So I just want to make sure I wash my loads, my color clothes, and have a clean apartment at the same time, you feel me? I am heading down to the visa place right now. We had to go all the way to call Berlin, the city. Uh, yes, I am meeting my teammate right now downstairs. We are on our way to Berlin, right? We are on our way to Berlin right now to get this visa done. And I think I found out I'm gonna be there all day for real, for real. So, wish me luck. Like, you guys have words that's combined together, and then your J's are silent. And what else is silent? Your, like, V, right? Your V's are silent too, in a way? Yeah. Oh. That's very interesting. How do you say your name, though? What is your question, though? See, I, I wouldn't even know how to say that. <laughs> question. Is it like part Dutch? Like, like in German? No. No? They got the absolutely different. different. So what's the difference, like, in a way? Words and, and I don't know how to say, but the, the whole, I don't know, hold on. See, this is the thing that we all got to know. I actually enjoy and respect the language and the culture. It's just learning it. It's another task itself. Okay, so it's a construction so we can, we can, of we can sentence. can say absolutely anything, everything. Right. 
and on the on the like first or hand on on the then oh, the it sentence. means something. Okay. But in German, when you say something bad, nobody will understand you. Uh, you just wondering, because I used to live in Germany for a year and a half, and it was hard to understand. But like I pick up a few words from Germany, so I'm trying to learn. I'm, trying, I'm learning still. In this weather right now, or this month, actually, it's still winter in March. So it's supposed to warm up in April. Ain't that crazy? April, that's when you start seeing, what, 50 to 60 degrees, maybe? Tops. Boy. Oh, boy. Now, tell me about this. Do you guys like the warm weather? Like 70 degrees, 80 degrees? Yeah, I, I don't care about the weather. But I, I know when during the winter, it'll be fucking cold. And after that, maybe I hate more summer because... It's too hot. Yeah. And in the helmet and shoulders, and you can grab, and, and yeah. So, how you so for me, this weather is better than the hot. Yeah. So if you were to go to Miami, <laughs> tell me this. I'd probably die. <laughs> That's what I'll say because working out out there is usually 80 to 90 degrees. In the hot sun, five minutes you're sweating. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, Nightmare. so so this is, this is my opposite here. This is like, what, 29 degrees now? And then my first time in practice here, it was like 36, but it felt like 15. And I was like shivering. I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> so it's kind of ironic that they're, the actual interesting of the winter, they're comfortable with winter instead of the heat, which is understandable because it's always cold all, all year round, pretty much to the finals last year. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I think I think we need like focus on ourselves, not on every team around or players around. But I think, especially last final, like everybody looking on each other and, and trying to find who will win it. And, right. And I mean, we need that. I, I don't know how to say, but that energy, like, I can I can win, I can win, I can be the one, that's what I think we need. Okay, yeah, because I saw the game, you guys played a great game coming back in the second half. Yeah. So, I think you guys have great spirit, and just now, just really finishing the game, for sure. Yeah, I think... Bad for me, but but during the final it helps. I I, I injured and everybody stopped looking at me and do, do something. And I was like I, I can't I can't breath. I can't. And they was like, yeah yeah, let's go let's go. And I was like, damn, I, I can't. I can't see the fucking ball. And after yeah. I was injured with concussion, so they they play like, yeah okay, I will do it. But before it, they was like, nah. They I was looking for myself. you. They were looking for you to yeah, get yeah. spark. Get it? That makes sense. I mean, yeah, it's tough. It's really tough when it comes down to that. Especially when you get down for an injury and a concussion and you're trying to go out there and still play. Yeah, I remember. I remember they were, they were like, definitely would throw you the ball. And then you got hurt. And it looked like it was like a shoulder injury at one point. And then you came back and you still played and then you came back again and it looked like it was your ankle and then it came back again and yeah, it was... I, I had the concussion from the first play. Concussion the first yeah, play? And I was wow. like, damn, I can see the fucking ball. And I got a headache as fuck. And I was like, damn, I'm gonna die on the field. Oh yeah, well, that's definitely, we don't want that to happen. And the last hit, I, I, I remember because I, 
I woke up in the hospital and all that. You woke up in a hospital? No, no woke up, but I don't. You don't. You just don't yeah, remember. Yeah, I don't remember. So. Yeah, that's understandable. So yeah, man, we we definitely gonna make a different impact from last year to this year and make something happen, make a bigger spark, you know? So healthy is the biggest key for everything in chemistry. Yes. I believe chemistry is the biggest thing too. It is American dream. You can live your dream out there, but you gotta work hard for it. You know what I'm saying? You yeah. gotta stay consistent. It's not like one of those things that things can happen, bro, and you can just lose it right there. Yeah, I think your system is good in that you can do everything what you want but right i don't i don't know i i don't understand the system because in our country we, we hurt and we going to hospital and they they have to do something but in us they they ask for like do you have insurance and you yeah you get that no. insurance you, you okay get the fuck out and well, yeah you, damn, you gotta pay you gotta pay this you gotta pay yeah. that and it's that's what it is. You have to have the money, and money runs the world right now. Like, yeah. So, like I said, you, whatever you want to see in America, you'll see it. It's beautiful. Don't get me wrong. Everything about America is beautiful. Yeah. It's depending how what you want to see and how you want to handle or seeing things. But you're you're gonna see the ugly part too. Yeah, I want to see reality. So. Yeah. So, that's that's the truth. It's literally, we have two more hours to get to Berlin. And there wasn't kidding when it says four hour drive <laughs> at all. It's a long drive. Man, it's a long freaking day. Tell you that right now. New flash. I thought that Berlin was in Czech Republic. Y'all don't laugh at me. Don't laugh at me. I forgot that it's in Germany. I feel ashamed as hell. Our drive and we finally made it. I'm telling you, it's been a long time. My lower back hurt, my tushy hurt. Yeah. Man, we finally in Berlin, Germany right now. And I am looking for the location so I can get the visa done. I know I'm close by, so I'm definitely gonna go ahead and explore. To get there right now, because we're pretty late. We got stuck in traffic. So that's what we're doing right now. I am trying to find this location. We finally made it inside. And he's doing my visa right now. And I'm glad we made it in time, man, so we can get this done. Now I just have to wait a half an hour for it to be done processing. And then we can go ahead and go back home, get something to eat before we go back home, and then hit the gym. That's how I be moving like this. Like, I'm, I'm shaking all the time because I'm, like, super cold. <laughs> But uh, yeah, it's not that bad right now. But if that wind hits, it is over for me, guaranteed. We are on our way back right now. It's gonna be nighttime when we get back. It's gonna be a nice, nice, nice drive, I'm telling you. I had to make a pit stop, gotta use the bathroom, man. So, we need to use it before we get back on the road. So, I had to charge a dollar to use the bathroom, bruh. A dollar just to get a pass to use a bathroom. That's crazy. It's, uh, we almost home right now. I am tired. My body's been aching. And man, I'm gonna let you guys know. I wanna say thank you guys for 
being here with me, subscribing to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Love.